shoot 62 percent in the set in the first half how much do you put really that, down the second, really 50 right yeah we all know Butler's an excellent offensive team how much of that do you put on Butler how much do you put on breakdowns by your own defense well they're hard to defend you know there's a lot of moving parts and they got guys that are versatile they run stuff get done done on looks and he cuts as good as anybody without the ball you know Christian did Christian did as good a good job as anybody like that kid but Roosevelt Jones he just takes what the defense gives them. He spoon feeds those other guys. Uh, and those other guys are all good players. I mean, we recruited all those guys. A guy like Keelan Martin, who I, in high school I told says a Paul Pierce type guy. Uh, these are good, smart basketball players. Veterans that are smart, that's where we got to get. We have to get smarter um, uh, and come along with our veteran guys. But uh, we shot ourselves in the foot by doing some things. We never guarded the ball screen correctly in the first half, I don't think. And then you can't give up easy that breaks you back giving up a transition basket but they're not easy to guard and they're going to take what you give them if you don't take something else away they're going to they're going to do this and then you, they throw it up there and they're they're a beast on the offensive boards coach you moved Brenton to a reserve role this year uh, but he's basically playing the same amount of minutes yes. as he did last year what was your thought process on that and how would you evaluate his play this season? He's a starter, and I like uh, him being able to see the game for a couple minutes, you know, before he comes off. Um, mentally, at both ends of the floor, he's got to be a little bit better, so maybe that helps him slow it down. And it was a two-point guard. Now, guys, people aren't guarding ever because they don't think he can shoot. He can make shots, and he just needs to take, take and make his open shots. But I like that. As a former point guard, I like having that true point guard out there. Devontae starting off the ball. Um, and it's a pretty darn good defensive backcourt with Everett, Devontae, and Christian. Greg, the message of encouragement that you started to talk about, how do you filter that through to the team in the scope of a loss? How, how do you kind of get them to understand? Yeah, they've never heard me say that. Usually I'm, you know, 85 points and 57% for the game. That's ridiculous. That's not us. We're right now going into at least the Missouri Valley field goal percentage team. Our defense is going to be fine. Um, we just have too many breakdowns, and it's a good, really good match. I thought they played well, too. I've, I've watched every game they've played. I watched us against them last year. Uh, I'd be shocked if coaches would say that they really played well tonight. But uh, we're, we're better than that defensively, but it's also the fact that they're really good and well put together. Uh, and I know we're much better than that on that. But, but that's why I guess I'm encouraged because of how hard we played. We shared the ball better on the, basket, on the, on the offensive end. 
And uh, I know we're better defensively, but you ran into a really good team that's very efficient. Some of the younger guys, Brandon Murphy, had moments today. Neal's played better defense than he has. Uh, you know, is that some things you can take away from this? Well, I think at the, our two forward positions, we got all those guys step up for them. And, and they know that. You know, they're trying. They're playing to get the good basketball players. So you see here, there's no place to hide out there. And that team right there does as good a job as anybody uh, with Michael Willis over there calling the plays of, of going at what they think of this match. And we just got, those guys got to be tougher, better. Brandon Murphy, uh, uh, Andre, and especially at the forward, Matt and Brandon, who are more experienced guys. We're going to get more productivity out of those guys.